We're just two guys playing games for fun. It's Button Mashing 101. Hey, welcome back to Button Mashing 101. We got magnets, we got batteries. We play Mega Man 9. It's pretty cray cray. Mmm. Mmm, Kimosabi. I think you're out of lives. Yeah, for sure. But I'm gonna keep playing. <laughs> Um, so this would just be my five favorite. Yeah. Not what I think are the best games. Correct. Okay. It would help if I remember what came out this year. Well, you heard my five. I mentioned some of the other big games. Although, you're a bit different than I am. Like, I... There was a long period where I didn't play any console games this year. It doesn't year. have to be a console game. Well, I mean, I just played League all day. Oh. Well, like, League doesn't count. Exactly. Because, like, Dota 2 came out this year. Yeah. It's fucking piece of shit. <laughs> like, there's like a m five months where I didn't play any console games. Yeah, that oh. was awesome. I was playing Vita games a lot, though. Yeah. So, there's definitely a lot of Vita games that I love this year. Tearaway is one of them. Tearaway's your favorite game. Tearaway is, well, it's recent, too, so, like, I'll forget about it in a couple months. You'll forget about it in a couple months. <laughs> Terror is fucking awesome though. It has all the charm of Little Big Planet, but I love the gameplay way more. Yeah, it's more varied gameplay, and it's less um, reliant on having multiple people there. Mm -hmm. And like Little Big Planet, like it's I, not as much fun without a bunch of people. Yeah, I love what Little Big Planet does with the whole create levels and shit. Yeah, but I like how Terraway didn't do that. Yeah, I like I. I'd much rather just have someone make a level for me. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to make levels. Then I'd get into game design. Yeah. There is a, um, do you see the DC Comics pack for Little Big Planet 2? Where it's yes. A, it's a whole bunch of costumes, and there's also like seven levels. I didn't see the levels, though. No. I thought about getting it for like when we hang out. Yeah. With our other friends who like stuff. Yep. Um, so Tearaway's one of them. Probably Dragon's Crown. I love the shit out of that game. Mm-hmm. 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 You just like boobs. I do like boobs. But I mean, I really like the gameplay of that game. Do you also like the bouncing boobs? Yeah, I already said that. Oh yeah. You didn't say bouncing. Mm, that's implied. <laughs> Is okay. it not implied? I don't know, dude. I always thought it was. See, I, I, I didn't include games like uh, Kingdom Hearts. Because it's a re-release. Re yeah. Yeah, of course not. Because next year my top five games would be like Tales of Symphonia HD, Final Fantasy X HD, Kingdom Hearts <laughs> 2 HD. And yeah, they, gotta be, they have to be new games. Obviously. Are you fucking me in my wow, dick right you now? you went right through that. You went right through it. Nah, I don't want to do it. I beat a boss. Alright, bosser. <laughs> I'm still thinking of fucking games that I played this year. Guacamelee's not up there for you? I really like it. I mean, it might be. It depends on what other fucking games I played. Soul Sacrifice was this Definitely... year? Definitely... Oh! Soul Sacrifice, not for sure. Forgot about that. See what I'm saying? Yeah. I have a terrible memory. Soul Sacrifice is one of my, like, honorable mentions. No, that's definitely... Dug that I game. love the shit out of that game. It's a Monster Hunter type game, but... I don't know. I get to play with my best friend Dave. Hey! What about Final Fantasy XIII 2? Do you want to fucking die? <laughs> you never even played that game. I don't give a shit. I'm actually pretty excited for 13 3 Lightning Returns or whatever. Yeah, you want to call well, it. you're a sucker. That game looks good. You're a sucker. Yeah, so what? And there's one born every second. Or is it minute? I don't know. I don't know P.T. Barnum. P.T. Barnum. Isn't that the circus guy? Yeah. He said there's a sucker born every minute or every second. Isn't and someone nice? was like, make up your mind. <laughs> wow! Look at that! <laughs> Fuck my ass! Right off my no, body! Oh, don't do that. Okay, so, definitely <gasps> top five so Jesus far. Jesus Christ. Tear away Dragon's Crown. Soul Sacrifice. I'm probably gonna go Beyond Two Souls. I really like that game. I love everything about that game, really. Yep, that game's so good. And it's like, people people don't like it. A lot of people don't like it, and people... I don't get it. I don't get it either, because they love the shit out of 
Heavy Rain? No. Pe a lot of people said Heavy Rain's stupid, too. But Heavy the... Rain was more universally acclaimed, critically acclaimed. And loved. But I mean, like, The yeah. Walking Dead. Everybody, everybody says that game's fucking the best. And it's the exact same game, just a different story. Well, I think the problem a lot of people have with Beyond is, like, your choices aren't really choices. Like, they feel like this should be a game where you are making choices, and they feel like their choices didn't matter. But my issue with that is, like, how many people loved The Last of Us, and there's absolutely no choice. Naughty Dog, like, wrote fucking dick shit bitch tits. <laughs> Naughty Dog, like, made a brilliant story, and you just played it, and you yeah. just experienced it. Yeah. And, I mean, there are choices to make in Beyond. I mean, they changed the ending. Yeah, but there's also little other things, too. It's not like Heavy Rain, where every choice, like, impacts the way, like, the next five minutes will play out for you. Yeah. But I think that's the problem, is too many people were expecting, like, Heavy Rain too, mm -hmm. But with much better voice acting. I don't know, I, I dug the... I dug everything about Beyond Two Souls more. Because the whole, like, Iden thing was fucking awesome. Yeah. I really, really like that. I still don't know if I've seen better graphics. Like, I have a PlayStation 4. <laughs> and fucking... Jody and Willem Dafoe, mm -hmm. they look so real. All the, the graphics in that game are so crazy. And, I mean, to me, I am i don't want to say The Last of Us is on my top five because I like that game, but it's still not, like, one of my favorite games. Oh, it would be an honorable mention because the story of that game is fucking good. I feel like if I beat Bioshock Infinite, that'll be on my top five. What if the ending's just fucking retarded? That's not what I've heard. And it's just like, it was all a dream. <laughs> if that was it, then... And, and you were Mario. Then if that was it, then I bet I would hate that game. <laughs> you were Mario. Way to reference, Dave. <laughs> what if you just jumped on the thing right there? I don't know if you can, because every time I like get close to it, I just turn invisible. Yeah. This is a pretty wacky mechanic, by the way. Why you don't jump from that guy? Because I'm a dumb. Because you're Adam? I'm a dumb. You're Adam. Adam West. You wish you were Adam West. Who doesn't? Me? Too much fame, bro. I don't get it. I don't get this mechanic. Like, sometimes you stick, sometimes you don't. Maybe you don't stick if you're, like, moving horizontally. I'm... regretting my decisions that led up to this point. <laughs> <laughs> Does to this guy out... have to be next? Is he, like, weak to plug? Yeah, he's weak to plug. Okay. To figure out what game we were playing today, I was flipping, uh, mint fudge cream Oreo. <laughs> True fact. I'm gonna look up a list of games that came out this year. Oh. That's why I couldn't find it. You wanna use my phone? Maybe. Da, 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 da. I'm trying to think of like what else is out for Vita. Yeah, I really love the Vita. I think I like it more than Dave does. I think you have to stop on that. I think you have to stop. Horsing around. Ooh! <laughs> See, I was gonna hit the spikes and there just wasn't shit I could do about it. It's okay, man. It's okay. Um. How many lives do I have? You look 80. I feel like this is just keep on trucking. Yeah, dude. Trucking. You should've went to the store. <laughs> you get some ice cream? No. Speaking of ice cream... I'm addicted to this fucking ice cream. What's that? It's... I think it's Dean's. It's Fannie Mae Mint Meltaway. Mmm. My god. You like, love mint. In case you guys haven't noticed, I love mint shit. But this ice cream is like a game changer for me. Like, my life is better because of this ice cream. <laughs> I used to be really depressed. I used to just really be really down on myself, down on life. And then once I got this ice cream, everything turned around. I got a job, I got a girlfriend, we have four kids, and they're all- Dude, that was quick. Yeah. That's what happened, like, we were trying to get pregnant, and we couldn't, but then I got this ice cream. Again, <laughs> after not having it for a long time, and fucking...
Maybe I should go make a bowl of it right now. <laughs> you want to try this? No. Oh, God. I was oh, depressed ooga. Sunday night. Why? Because I have to start over, man. My streak. Oh, and the Bears lost. I am the Bears lost. Is that why you got sick? Probably. You were like, man, I feel great. And then that fourth and eight happened, and you just <laughs> puked everywhere. God, that was a fucking stupid game. But seriously, it was actually longer than eight years, because I can't do math when I'm half asleep. You've come a long way. Since Throw Up Boy. <laughs> when I never actually threw up. Yeah, Dan used to be known as Throw Up Boy. <laughs> when I never threw up. When we worked at Office Depot. Because <laughs> he used to just call off, oh, I threw up. <laughs> hey man, I wanted a day off, and if I just said, oh, I don't feel good, they'd be like, oh, come in. What about the time you made up that you had vertigo? Dude, that's not made up. I'm fucking dead serious on that shit. Like, I've told you so many things in my life that, like, I've lied about, but it's like... No, I'm fucking totally serious about that shit. <laughs> Next time on Butt Meshing 101, we're gonna beat this level. No. Yeah, we are. No. You. Okay. <laughs>